Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and very good day to you all. Okay, for this video, we are going to continue about example 8.2 from the book uh, Shigli Mechanical Engineering Design, chapter 8 about the screw. So, bring your paper and your calculator and your pen beside you. Uh, we are going to do some calculation. Example 8.2 is shown in figure 817A. This is figure 817. Okay. Uh, two plates are clamped with by washer one half inch uh, 20 UNF uh, times one uh, and half inch SA grade 5 volts each with standard uh, half uh, and steel pen washer. Determine a, the number A1 determine the member spray rate KM if the top plate is steel and the bottom plate is grey cast iron. Number two, using the method of conical frasta, determine the member stiffness rate if both plates are steel. Number three, using the 823, determine the member spring rate KM if both plates are steel. Compare the result with B. And D is determine the bolt spring rate. Okay, from table A32, thickness of spring half and plane washer is 0.095 inch. Okay, so when you get the number name of that washer, okay, you refer to this table A32. Okay, it is a standard table, and then you get the thickness, thickness, standard thickness, or you can take the micrometer, you measure what is the uh, what okay, you use the ruler or uh, more precise a uh, micrometer. And then you measure what is the uh, thickness of the washer. Okay. So uh, the frasta is the halfway of the joint. So half in you get 0 0.6725 inchi. The thickness of the uh, the frasta. Okay. The, uh, meaning the force distributed from uh, okay, from here when you clamp. Okay. The this thickness, okay, the force distribution is going into that that level, okay, that length. Okay, solution B is member. You want to find the member of spring rate using frasta method, okay. Remember, frasta is a is a cone, okay, that you cone that you cut, okay, at the both at the upper level of the cone, not the middle level. You cut at the upper level of the cone. So it will it is representing the boat. Okay. Uh, how the pressure distribution at the boat. Okay. So the distance between the joint line and the tethered dotted plaster line is 0 0.06725. Okay, and then you uh, minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.095, you get 0 0.075 inchi. And then the top rasta consists of steel washer, steel plate, and 0 0.05 inch of cast iron. See the washer and top plate are uh, both steel with E. Yang modulus, uh, this yang modulus 30, uh, 30 power of 6 uh, psi. And then you could, they can be considered as single frustum in uh, 0 0.595 inch it. So meaning that this top and the washer, it has the washer. Okay. Okay, all of it can be considered 0 0.595 inch, okay, because it's made from the uh, same material. Okay, the outer diameter of the frustum of steel member or joint interface is, uh, you can get 0 0.75 plus, uh, then you get 1.437, okay, outer diameter of the frustum of, uh, of steel member. And then the outer meter at midpoint, entire joint is 1.5727 uh, inchi. And then you get the spring rate of steel is K1 equals to this. And then you can get, okay, you can get it. 30.8 uh, pound per inchi. Okay. From table 88, uh, 085, the for grass, gray grass iron, gray grass iron, uh, E equal to 14.5. Mega PSI task for upper cast iron frustum is K2 equal to this equation. Uh, you put all the value and you get 285.5 uh, power of 6 pound per inch. And lower cast iron uh, frustum, you get this uh, K3 equals to this. And then the three frustum in series, KKM 
equal to this or these three value because from the the equation it will consist of uh, different material you remember uh, it is recommended highly recommended you use the same material however some of the time you you don't have that same material with you you just get whatever you can get from the hardware maybe the hardware is uh, out of stock what do you want to buy you just buy what can fit okay the fit is uh, the the uh, the ball the same different material the nut is different material because there is no stock just buy and then with the when it can be connected okay it can be attached okay uh, perfectly and by the end uh, the when you do the calculation you want to find the member of the spray read you will become different members okay so like this km equals to they are three because they are three washer they have a bolt they have another bolt uh, below one this, this below bolt okay so this is different material washer and this different material this also different material so you have the different uh, stiffness so the answer for b is km equals to 9.378 uh, power of 6 uh, pound per inch if the entire joint is steel if from the equation 8 to 2 with l equal to uh, 2 2.06 0725 you can get uh, the 1.3 for five inch okay okay if both plates are still km equals to this uh, you can get you put all the value inside uh, this km equation and then from the table 88 e equals to you see here because it's material you can see in this table 787 here 628 here meaning that it's made from the steel okay and then equation a to 3 give this equation uh, this uh, value and you get 14.92 power of 6 okay for this case different between result equation is less than 2% okay you make the you compare the differences within the result the, it is less than 2% following the procedure of 8 uh, saber the threaded length of, of 0.5 inch bolt is lt equals to this uh, okay 1.25 inch okay the length of the entire portion is ld is 1.5 minus 1.25 you get 0 0.25 inch you take the easy one to do the question this question you take your pen you sketch and then you can get the idea what is uh, this question is talk about okay the length of entire portion grip is lt equals to this uh, and the major diameter is a and then from the table 8.2 the tensile strength, stress area is 1.0.159 and then the stiffness of bolt KB B stands for stiffness of bolt okay uh, you can get 3.69 uh, pound per inch this is bolt spring rate that's all for this video I hope you can practice practice and practice uh, uh, for this uh, this calculation, and we see you in the next video. We are talking about 8.6 bolt strength. Thank you very much.